everyone welcome to my channel my name is Sevin we are practicing AVS in Cloudcast we are in solutions architect role and today we are going to do decoupling applications thanks for coming to aid of the space center this is what we are going to see now that's the problem and we are going to solve the problem with all these applications that we are going to learn our space program runs every la very large events every time or sat our satellite provides deep space images and videos in fact we have a we have an event coming up soon well we have received compliance that some video and image searches are yielding null results and dropping results our satellite has also had issues pending sending back large images because of because our website has was overloaded with traffic is there anything we can do to improve our image or video delivery system i believe that decoupling your application can help in this case using amazon simple query service also known as amazon sqs you can redundantly store data requests in a queue until they can be processed by your backend applications. These avoids dropped requests or over overloaded backend resources. Can we automatically notify users when new videos and images are available? Sure, we can use Amazon Simple Notification Service to publish messages to, to a topic that you define, such, such as satellite subscribers, su subscribers, so that topic can receive notifications of new SNS messages whenever you want, such as when new videos or images are available. Sounds great. We want our users to enjoy the satellite discoveries without frustration. Can you help our space program to improve its image, image and video delivery system? Yes, accept that challenge and start practicing. This is how the architecture will look like. Message producer, SNS topic, application to application and then message customer message customer and let's see what we are going to do we are going to create amazon sns topic create amazon sns sqs queue subscribe to sqs queue to to the sns topic this is what it looks like and then we are going to create additional sqs query and subscribe it to existing sns topic Okay, now we fix the technical issue. Um, the technical I changed the region as advised by uh, support, AVS support, and after changing the region, I was able to see my AV, uh, EC2 instances. Now I'm going to go to simple notification service, SNS, create a topic, image notification, and next step standard go down and create the topic we are going to copy here a number because we are going to need it let's open a new page for the new lab and now we can go to sqs simple query service we are going to create a queue image queue image queue I need to download the lab files and open it did I download it okay let's open the file okay and this is my code in the we will select the advanced and we have the code where we are going to paste it just under the resource. Let's copy, copy this and after And just after line 15, we are going to copy that and go on. Oh, sorry. Now we need to copy this resource ARN number. And we are going to write this to SQSQ ARN. The one that we just previously copied was here. Copy this one and and for the 
SNS topic here and press this one. Okay, now we can create the cube. So let's copy URL. Go to SNS subscription, subscribe to Amazon SNS topic. Use existing resource, save. Let's go to EC2 instances. I'm going to pass the top uh, URL number here just in case. Now the, we can go to instances in EC2 and select thumbnail. This is the IP address. Open it and I'm going to add thumbnail. Okay, so now add thumbnail. Sorry. Add thumbnail to the end. This way it didn't load. Let's do that again. Uh, we need to copy that. Paste here. Add forward slash and thumbnail. Thumbnail. Now it's working this way. Now you can pass the URL here and submit. It's now submitted. Let's go to loader UI um, and copy public IP address, paste it here. Type loader. Once it is SNS topic here and is just here. And submit. Pull is a delete image start. Message received from SQS. Okay, wait until this is showing. It's complete. In um, DIY section, we need to create additional SQS queue and subscribe it to our existing SNS topic. So let's go back and do that. Let's go to SQS and create a queue. Create another queue. Uh, my queue DIY queue. And then we need to go to advanced, take the code from here, the previously opened from here, from the line 15, passed here, and the ARN number, take this resource ARN, passed it here. And now SNS topic was the one that previously created. Here image notification, Aaron. This is the topic we created. And this is how we saved it. Create queue. This is the URL number. We need to copy that. Subscribe. Go to subscribe to okay save let's write the sns topic irn it's the same one that we already have this is the one that previously and sqq url that we just created url number is here and validate Okay, this is validated. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this session. I'm going to see you in my next one. Bye. If I don't like holy, you had a then hell.